came up with this. And this is my class. So here's what's going on with this smiley heart. We've got baking soda for the eyes and the mouth, lithium chloride around the perimeter of the heart, and then a copper two chloride rim. We're gonna put some methanol on it, and then we're gonna ignite it. All right, well. Look at that. Well, if your kids are on TikTok, you might know our next guest. Philip Cook is a science teacher from Northern Indiana who's been making popular videos featuring science experiments. He's known as At Chem Teacher Phil. He joins us live via Skype. How are you? I'm great. How are you, Robin? I'm doing great. And I know uh, you're doing a lot of these great experiments on TikTok, and the kids love the TikTok. So can you show us a couple? Should we start with this uh, disposable diaper experiment? Yeah, so I want to show you some stuff that maybe you can try at home if okay. you have access to these materials. So there's actually some pretty cool chemistry in diapers, disposable diapers. And there's a polymer in there. And the polymer is called sodium polyacrylate. I'll show you really quickly what it does. Okay. And then I'll show you how you can do this experiment at home. So this is the polymer. It's a white powder. And the neat thing about it is it's very hydrophilic. That means it really likes water. So if we take some water and we add it into the polymer, it's going to rapidly absorb that polymer. The polymer oh, yeah, look at that. Oh, and that's the stuff that's in the diaper? Yeah, this is the same stuff. Now, it's, this is a little bit higher purity because you notice how it fluffs up really yeah. nice. Yeah. But here's how you can do the same experiment at home. Now, I had to go buy these because my kids are 18, 15. <laughs> <laughs> but you can get them at the store pretty yeah. readily. It's not like toilet paper or anything. So you take the diaper, and it's pretty simple. You got to kind of loosen up the middle. So you take the diaper, you loosen up the middle. You want to feel that kind of cottony material loosen because all the polymer is on the back side. Oh. Scissors. Yeah. Which we have at home. And you're going to cut through the top layer just so you can get the polymer out. And once you've got it, it's going to oh. look messy. And it might release a little bit of dust, so that might cause you to sneeze a little bit. I do the next part in a Ziploc bag. A gallon Ziploc bag works really nicely. OK. Turn it upside down, seal it up. Okay. And then take out your frustrations of being in quarantine for so long. And what you're looking for is our, these little sandy mm -hmm. annuals. Yeah. That, that same chemical that you saw me pour into a, a beaker just a minute huh. ago. So if you take it, get rid of everything else including the fluff oh. and you're not getting a lot it all depends on the diaper size yeah your diaper sizes are going to have more of this hmm. you're going to add it into a container like a measuring cup at home i'm just using a beaker because i'm working out of my lab this morning and so you've got a little bit not quite as much as what i showed you previously and you add some water to it and what you're going to notice is it will start to do the very same thing. Now, depending on the quality of the brand of diaper that you use, you're going to get a different effect every single time. But you can see, oh, look at oh, that. Yeah. you can lock in that water. You can have kids do experiments with this where they try different brands of diapers, or you just see how much water it can hold before it gets uh, kind of to the point where it's running. And it's perfectly safe to handle, which is another good thing if you're working at home with uh, small kids and they want you want something to do to keep them occupied for a little bit. Yeah, it's a fun little experiment. Well, well, you know what? I know we're we're short on time, but I I so we can only do the one experiment today. But this is so fascinating. We're gonna have to have you back because you do little mini stuffs on, on TikTok, and I know kids are trapped inside and their parents are losing their mind. I'm just speaking for myself. Yeah. So we hope <laughs> you'll join us again in the very near future, if that's okay. Whenever you want, I'm oh, here. I right. love it. Thanks That's so much. You, you can check them out on TikTok at Chem Teacher Phil. Lots of great stuff. We'll be right back. Thanks, though.